Hey guys, it's Jen. Um, we did a craft haul. We went to Hobby Lobby today. Um, some of it's for me, some's for the kids. This is actually um, an order for someone. I'm making them some uh, like christening blankets. We'll see how much four skeins gets me. I'm making two of them. And my children, my older three, for part of our homeschool class um, this week, I taught them how to um, crochet a chain. And um, so, sorry, I'm trying to find the other screen. So um, they've been crocheting necklaces and bracelets and all kinds of things. So I went to pick them up some of their own yarn because um, they're kind of making a mess of mine. Maybe crafter's Secret, it's inexpensive when they start actually making um, like like hats and scarves and things, then I'll get them nicer yarn, but for right now, just for them making what they're making, this is great. So I let them each pick a color. Um, Ruben picked this pretty dark green, and Anara picked yellow, and Thatcher picked out this camo color. It's browns and greens. Um, and then I also let Anara get this one. They had a bunch of yarn on sale. And this is pale pink with kind of iridescent sparkle. And she thought that was super pretty, so I let her get that one. Um, and then I picked up some cotton yarn. I got brown. I'm sorry, the lighting in here sucks. It really does right now. But I got a dark brown and kind of a warm mid-tone brown. And I got an orange and a pretty kind of a sage green. I'd wish that they had a softer shade of orange, but they just didn't. And I also got this one. It was really pretty. Um, and all of these, I want to say they were $1.69, but all of the I Love This cotton was on sale. This was also on sale. This is pink tulle. Um, my daughter really wants, um, what's it called? A tutu. So I'm going to teach her how to make herself a tutu. Last time I made her when she was two years old, and it's going to be her eighth birthday here in a couple months. So picked this up. All of the Sewology Notions were 50% off, so this was not actually $9.99. I really like getting these mixed button ones, um, and I always look at the thrift stores like, um, you know, like button jars, like grandma button jars. I always look for those just to get a whole bunch of, of um, you know, cool buttons. So I grabbed that, and with the Sewology Notions being 50% off, I grabbed some of this woven wide elastic. This is good for certain types of skirts. Um, I wanted to get the white background with the silver or the gold, but the ones that were this wide were not the Zoology brand, so they were not on sale. So that was 50% off, and then I got two narrower ones that were also 50% off. Picked these up from, sorry, my nose is just the remnant section. This is blackout curtain lining. It was marked down pretty nicely, I thought. Um, but we picked up two of these to hopefully have enough. In my daughter's room, I use vintage floral sheets as her drapes, and they're getting really badly sun bleached, and they really don't block much light. They kind of soften it, but they really don't block much. And at night, especially in the summer when it stays light so late, it's really hard for her to sleep. So we're hopefully going to make um, some drapes to put behind the other drapes. Um, with the kids getting into crochet, I went through all of my hooks and I gave them the duplicate sizes I had, but they didn't have some of the smaller sizes. And um, this one is a size I, and I like that for worsted weight. I tend to use it a fair amount. They've been doubling theirs to do some stuff, but um, yeah. I needed eyes, and I didn't end up finding the eyes I went for, but I did pick up um, some other ones because I did have, uh, have some projects. This one is 15 millimeter brown eyes. And then this one, these are little 12 millimeter, and these are just the plain black ones. But I wanted these, but like tiny, like, I don't know, like maybe that big. And they didn't have anything that small, so I don't know where I'm going to find them. I might have to look online. I got this for me. I want to see if I can do a rug with this. Um, I have lots of t shirts to chop up. We grabbed these. We're actually going to use these. We were looking at um, toothbrush holders because we have one, but that's not enough for all of our toothbrushes. So the 
because you're using it right now but like it's one of the ones that just has like this type of thing at the top and then a round thing at the bottom and it's open throughout and the kids will just kind of toss their toothbrush in and it doesn't always go to the bottom sometimes it kind of slides through and so this is um there's multiple in here i think there's at least two so my husband found these so we're actually just going to put these in some mason jars and have those on the bathroom counter and use those for toothbrush holders which i thought was pretty cool they had a wide mouth one too i'm not actually sure what it's for oh yeah it's to just be like a little holder so um we got bridge mix we always get this bridge mix when we go to hobby lobby like since my oldest who is now 10 was a toddler my husband always or my husband and i always get it i have a gift i need to give to a friend this week and i forgot to grab gift bags at walmart so these were originally 5.99 we got it for 3.59 it's a three pack they're really pretty nice quality um so then i'll have one on hand next time i need one and I picked up this ribbon. They had several packs. If I hadn't been getting so much stuff already, I probably would have gotten more. But just these little um, assortments of ribbon. Total in bag is 30 yards. It says 15 assorted strips of ribbons. They are 2 yards each, and it was only $1.99. I think they had 4 other bags. So I thought that was great. There's really pretty colors in there. And for the most part, what I use ribbon for, I don't need longer than two yards um, at a section. So that was perfect. <laughs> and last but not least, we picked up Play-Doh for Apollo. That kid loves Play-Doh so much. We usually get um, Crayola or I make it. Um, this was $6.99. And we did use the 40% off coupon, but honestly, I don't know what we used it on. Um, it might have been this, but... Uh, so we picked this up to hopefully keep him busy. Like when I'm doing lessons with the older kids, he can play Play-Doh. Um, or if he's just seeming to need kind of a quiet activity to kind of focus on something that he can really mash and get into and do stuff with and not get so agitated. So, you know, because he's three. So that is what we got. Sorry, the lighting sucks, guys. Um, <laughs> just trying to do this before the kids descend on their new yarn tomorrow. And I won't be able to find a full skein for anything, so... This is what we got. I hope you guys are having a great week. If you like seeing more of our crafty hauls and our homeschool type stuff on this channel, please let me know. I do have another channel that I actually created before this one, and that's usually where I put them, but I'm hoping to kind of consolidate more of this over onto um, our family channel because it's, you know, kind of encompasses everybody. So anyway, I hope you guys are having a great week. I will talk to you all later. Thanks for watching. Bye.